Oh, Isabel, that was so cute. Look at how happy she is today, you guys. I bet Isabel is the kind of person who's going to be breaking out her new Bojo planter like immediately and getting ready to do all sorts of like different planning spreads with her journals and organizing all of her to-do list and her productivity workflow. Isabel, I wish you the best. Those days are going to be behind me now. However, happy new year to all of you. I can't wait to see what this year brings. Okay, she's precious. And yes, you guys, if you are watching this the same day I'm recording it, you may know that we're being a little wibbly wobbly with time. Shh, don't tell Rossetti. I just was busy hanging out with chips on New Year, so, you know, shh. Right now in Wildberry, it's 3.30 p.m. on Saturday, January 1st, 2022. It's another lovely Saturday and KK is performing in the plaza. He loves audience requests, so if there's anything you'd like to hear, stop by the plaza and let him know. That's all for today. Have fun out there. Oh my gosh, she seems extra cheerful. And it's probably because Isabel is totally the type of personality who would be like, oh, I have so many new planners to break out. It's a new month, a new year. Just all of the new ideas that she would want to put down. And I hear you there, Isabel, because I am the same way. <laughs> So today, friends, welcome, welcome to a new year here on Wildberry Island, where it really amazes me to think how a year ago today we didn't have, you know, snow on the island, because I wasn't here, and we didn't even have gyroids or the ability to cook or the amazing farm that we've got down at Cranston's place, and we didn't even have our wonderful villagers Gladish and Blanche on the island yet. I can't believe all of that happened just over Vlogmas. It's been amazing. And so today, we're going to be celebrating a new year on Wildberry by kind of like checking in on some of the old ideas now that I think about it. In fact, here, we need to go ahead and we need to prepare ourselves. I know I'm going to be quite intrigued and have a lot of ideas for things we should do on Wildberry. So I'm going to go ahead. Surprise! To me, this should say, Eureka! <laughs> Because that's what I think about every time I see that. Uh, but today we're going to wander around Wildberry Island and we are going to just greet everybody and say Happy New Year. And I'm also going to start a new list. Here, I have the list right now. I'm pulling it out so that... Here, do you hear the paper? There's the, the formal application of paper and pen coming down right this moment so that we can go ahead. Here, let me... Uh, oops, not to da. All right, here we go. Daydreaming. So that we can go ahead and say ideas, idea map for Wildberry. As I said, the days of doing to-do lists are behind me because I am starting off the new year strong like that. And you can check out our community vlog in order to kind of get a taste for what the future of our channel and the future of my life is going to be. Idea maps, compasses, concepts that we can maybe follow, but not strict to-do list. Uh, and basically, I'm going to write down all the ideas I have for stuff to do in Wildberry whilst we're visiting with the villagers so that we can make sure to go ahead. Hmm, I want to have some clapping going on here. Some good new emotions for the new year, if you ask me. Where's clapping? Like, I'm really happy. Oh, Eager is so cute, too. There we go. Delight! Oh, Delight is so perfect. Here, I'm not going to be fearful. Uh, but what else do I want to kind of show off? What, what does Eager look like? Okay, that's precious. We're going to have some eagerness as well. And we're going to come up with some plans on what we can go ahead and we can do here on Wildberry. Yes! Uh, but mostly also just greet everybody for the new year. Speaking of which, do I have a cool recipe of food I could potentially make that I haven't made yet? Let's go for something maybe savory. So I haven't made seaweed soup um, for everybody, I don't think. Let's see, I haven't made anchovies because I don't have any anchovies. Have I made all of the food? Hmm, what's something that just seems to shout like, eat me for New Year's? Hmm. Hmm. Nochi? <laughs> it's just kind of my go-to because it seems nice and warm. You know what? Maybe we'll make something sweet instead. Um, it turns out cherry jelly doesn't sell for a lot. Uh, should I just do more pound cake? Veggie cupcakes? Have I made veggie cupcakes? What on earth? Maybe coconut cookies. Coconut cookies seem like a good bet for the new year. That seems kind of festive. Huh. Let's go check the DIY on the beach and see if there's any other ideas that spring to mind. Do I have any food in my pockets? <gasps> I have a lot of stuff and a carrot cake in my pockets. All right. Oh, hey, and it's Adi. Adi, happy new year. Huh? Siri, it's been a while. Wow, ages. Yeah, it's been ages since I last saw you. Adi, it's just been since Christmas. I had to like go visit my family. Were you seeing a way seeing a show or something, even though your fave pop star is right here on the island? 
I get it. It's totes important to see the world. Just don't forget to hang out with me sometimes, okay? <laughs> all right, Audie, all right. Happy New Year! Here's to another year of fun times here on Wildberry. Okay, that's adorable. I should go see if the Nookling Brothers actually are selling some sort of delicious food. <gasps> and Cranston's doing New Year's yoga? I need to do my yoga today. I did some yoga yesterday, actually, so that needs to go on the list. Let's see, we got a school desk. Oh, these are all the, the gifts the villagers gave us. All right, fox shearling boots. Warrior, that's right, warrior armor, because Octavian sees me as a warrior for the island. Oh, bless him. All right, let's see. School uniform with necktie, gaming desk, knit hat, raincoat, a school desk. We'll just put all of these things away for now. And look at Cranston, you guys. Professor Pye, where have you been for the last one week? <laughs> I was visiting family for the holidays, I'm back. Everyone's been worried about where you were. I'm happy to see you again. You've got to say hi to everybody, then we can hang out, come cake. <laughs> okay, okay, Cranston. Happy New Year. It's our first time talking to each other in 2022. That's real neat. Oh shoot, I meant to say, Happy New Year, Professor Pye. And then I say crumb cake too, because I like you. Cranston, I love you. He makes me so happy, you guys. All right, let's go ahead and we'll see if the Nookling Brothers are selling anything today that's food related, because you know, it's New Year's. And if not, I will cook up something delicious. Oh, look at our festive little spread of items. Oh, hey, Jay. Hey, Asiri. Long time no see. What are you up to? Me? I'm up to almost 7,000 push-ups a day. Bet you can't beat that. Happy New Year, Siri. Welcome to 2022. Oh, I love how excited all the villagers are. All right, let's go see what the Nooklings have. Because if they have, like, some sort of delicious New Year's noodles, which I would really love to be able to make, then we'll buy that for all of the villagers. <gasps> they do have a food! Hello, hello. Welcome to Nook's Cranny. Boys! Oh, what's this? Spaghetti Giannivis Felicitis. It's green. Okay. So I think literally I was just talking about noodles. We're going to go ahead and let me see if you can eat this. And I'm going to give it to everybody for New Year. And then somebody can have a carrot cake. Yay. All right. So let's actually say these are going to be like everybody's New Year's wishes, you guys. So I need to buy 10 of them. And then we need to say hello to everybody on Wildberry. And that's going to take so long, then maybe like next time we'll go ahead and start our idea map where we go around and we basically are making a list of messes that I need to clean up on Wildberry. And then we'll see what Isabel ranks the island as well. All right. We got this, boys. We got this. Let's see. Thir four. Oh, I hope I have enough money to like buy everybody some fancy like takeout. This is so cute. I should probably get myself one as well. Like, maybe? I, I, I wouldn't mind having a really cute restaurant somewhere on the island where we could kind of rotate out food. I've been thinking building a little ramen shop would be really adorable. So that is indeed on the list. How many are we at now? Two, four, six, seven. So three more. I'm gonna end up spending all my money on spaghetti. I don't even like spaghetti in real life. At least if it has tomato sauce. I'm learning that if it has like homemade vegan Alfredo mushroom sauce, then we're talking. All right, there we go. Two, four, six, eight, nine. One more. This is perfect. These will be our New Year's wishes to everybody. All right, thank you very much, boys. And I'm gonna grab one more for myself. That's probably a little excessive. We have literally just bought all of the spaghetti, but I think it's going to be perfect. All right, and then let's see what we've got up here. Hmm, very cute. Okay, we're going to have to see if I can afford the Moroccan sofa at some point, because that would make an amazing outdoor sofa, and I'm sure that Reese would be able to recolor that at some point. All right, thank you, boys. Let's take these New Year wish noodles off. <laughs> New Year wish noodles, that's really cute. And let's go visit with everybody and see what they have to say about the special New Year's Day. Oh, Octavian! Good timing! It's Butterbean. I ain't spoken to you in a while, it seems. I was worried I'd done scared you off. <gasps> Octavian! Oh my gosh, he's so precious. Well, I know you got your own affairs to attend to, so I'll let you get to it. Good to see ya. Oh, thank you, Octavian. Happy New Year. Glad your smile was the first thing I saw this year. He's so kind. What do you need, aliens? Alright. So let's see what Octavian's New Year's wishes for us are today. New Year's Noodles, Octavian? Well, 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 you can trust this octopus nose. Alright, alright, and... Love rugby uniform! 
<laughs> so you wish me a very active new year. Thank you, Octavian. All right, well, there you have it. So that's from Octavian. Oh, hey, look who's hanging out with all the puppies. None other than Prince Julian. If I didn't have New Year's noodles for him, that hopefully will go really well in the soup that he's got, uh, I would totally go ahead and give him this outfit because it would suit him so very well. Also, there's a ton of snowflakes going around and it's still snowy season. So I need those in order to make cool snowflake stuff. All right, let's grab these. Also, they're just really pretty. I might leave more down as decorations everywhere. All right. Julian, do you want to stand up so I can give you some food? Oh, it really is you. For a second there, I didn't even recognize you. It's been that long. You know, I was just thinking about you the other day, wondering what you were getting up to. Guys, I was only gone for a week because I was visiting my family. Well, not like in real life I was at home, but I'm just going to pretend for, you know, the immersive roleplay experience here in Wildberry that I left the island to go visit with my husband and other family members. I'm just glad to see you're still here on Wildberry, and I'm hyped to see what you do next. Julian, what's coming up next is some New Year's noodles. Carp diem. I think that's la Latvani for Happy New Year, right? Anyway, let's have a good one, okay? All right, thank you, Julian. I'll be back in a minute. All right, hilarious as usual. Oh, look, oh! Okay, I'll try to build myself the snowman later, and I'll show you guys what the results were if I get a good, oh, look at Sky! If I get a good DIY from the snowman or not. Butterbean, where have you been? Is everything okay? Let me guess, I, get, I bet you've been hiding out reading a good book. Ironically on point, Sky, I have indeed been reading a lot of very good books lately. If I'm right, you have to share it with me when you're done. I want to wish you a happy new year. Here's hoping it's the best one e uh, ever for both of us, Novel. Oh, right? Okay, so Sky is... Oh, she stopped! She stopped! New Year's noodles time! All right, so let's go ahead and see what her wishes are for us for the new year. Ah, uh, should I give her carrot cake? <gasps> I'm going to give her carrot cake because there's a balloon in the background! Mama Sky! New Year's, New Year's wishes, New Year's wishes! Oh, simple sunglasses so that we can see the beauty of the world. Thank you, Mama Sky. Very fitting for you. Pardon me. I also happen to see a balloon. All right, let's go get it, guys. Okay, let's see. Where is my... Oh, it went up top. Did it go up top? Okay, it's over this deadly batch of roses. There's no way I'm going to be able to get it if it goes up this deadly batch of roses because the present will be lost to their thorns. Jeez, the flowers are spreading so fast again. It took Chips days to help me get them under control last time. <gasps> a cafe uniform! Oh, that's kind of adorable. Okay, that actually looked kind of like a uniform you would wear at a movie theater. So I might kind of keep that in my back pocket as something we might give the villagers in the future when we might have like movie night somewhere. I really need to work on the island, but that's for tomorrow, making the idea map of Wildberry. Meanwhile, let's see how Sheldon's doing for the new year. Aww. Guys, he's been decorating! He decorated with one of the gifts we gave him, and he decorated with the little Yeti uniform we gave him when he was ice skating. Oh, if it isn't Rutabaga! It's been a while. Are those new clothes? They really show off your biceps, Novel. Thank you very much, Sheldon, for not acting like I just died. Happy New Year, Rutabaga. Welcome to 2022. Happy New Year, Sheldon. All right, let's go ahead. We're going to give him some New Year's noodles and see what his wishes are for us for the new year. New Year's noodles, Sheldon. All right, let's see how he's doing. And here's something for you. A cardigan school uniform top. Take it. Don't be shy. Is that to say you want us to like really be more formally educated this year? All right, let me get a good look at this. Wow, that's fancy! It even has a little bow on it. Okay, so I'm going to interpret that as Sheldon is going to be continuing his education this year, which maybe means we need to make some more trails through the forest in order for him to go ahead and like have little education stations. In fact, I'm going to put that down on our idea map for Wildberry right now. Let's see, whoops. Let's see, let's see. Here we go. All right, so Sheldon, forest trails with info centers. OK, 
Because I could see how you'd want people to learn more about, like, walking through the woods. Alright, let's see. Who's gonna be next for our New Year's Noodles Bash? Sky's still having a good time over there. Kiki's down here. Nobody's hanging out in the square just yet. Jay was around here a minute ago. Hmm. Oh, look! Look at the flowers! They're blooming and they're so beautiful, you guys! Wow! Oh, I'm gonna put these Camillas everywhere. Oh my gosh. Okay, they're so much more stunning than I thought they would be. I'm gonna definitely be putting those all over the place. And it's Ani again! Ani, let's go ahead and see what you would wish us for wishes for the new year. Alright, so she wishes... A stand mixer! Okay, so Ani, that's amazing. <laughs> And she heard I love those, so I think that she really loves all of the cooking. I wonder if Audie might want to have something to do with actually having like a little restaurant on our island. So I'm going to put down Audie loves cooking. Because maybe what we'll do is we might move Jay's house around a little bit and Audie's house around a little bit so that Audie can have like a cute little cafe down there, which I think would be delightful. Cranston, my boy, how are you doing? Hey again, you keep checking up on me today, huh? Of course, Cranston. All right, let's go ahead and give him spaghetti. New Year's noodles, Cranston. And your wishes for the new year are? Uh, here, Professor Pie, a tropical cut and sew tank. Just for you, crumb cake. Oh, are you wishing for like some more tropical plants over in your bug garden, Cranston, to take care of more of your bugs? This is really cool! What? I love this! Okay, so Cranston, I'm gonna put tropical plants for his bugs. How cute would it be if we could fill up his house with all of the vines and moss stuff we've been finding? I just need to go ahead and continue to work on getting my license from Happy Home Paradise so we can edit his house. Or, excuse me, <clears throat> rearrange and suggest interior decoration for his home. Alright, tropical plants for his bugs. Cute. I love coming up with these little ideas. All right, so he's doing that. Gladys is inside. Oh, Blanche, you're over here visiting with Gladys. Noted. Oh my, Siri, it's been a while, hasn't it? Oh, I know who you are. You always keep yourself so busy. Well, I do. <laughs> just be sure to take some you time, darling. Oh, also, I'm just walking around with no pants. Sorry about that, Gladys. Or excuse me, Blanche. Oh my gosh, it begins. Happy New Year. I can't believe it's already 2022. One year just isn't as long as it used to be. Oh, oh that's way too on point. Way too close, Blanche. All right, let's see what her wishes for the new year are. While well, we're standing next to this adorable pineapple gyroid. Oh my, did you know one of my favorite things is spaghetti? All right, New Year's noodles and a dotted raincoat. Blanche, let's see. Dotted raincoat. How am I going to interpret this? Hmm... Okay, that's really cute. Um, and it's stone, huh? I'm gonna interpret that as Blanche, Blanche with a stone colored dotted raincoat. How about a Zen garden? I'm gonna write that down. Cause that's what it made me think about when I was looking at it, was a little Zen garden. And let's see what Gladys is up to. I really wanna make a beautiful uh, like flower arranging place in front of her home. Oh, Gladys! Oh no, you sat down! Hey there, it's been a while. Wildberry seems kind of empty without you, Stretch. Oh, thank you, Gladys. Um, oh look, she's got the puppy we gave her, you guys! Oh, that's so much fun to be able to see all of the puppies! Oh, okay, I think Gladys does not want her New Year's noodles at the moment. She might have to get them tomorrow because she is going to be sitting and reading her book forever. However, I think that means that Diva is actually going to be the one currently doing a DIY and available for uh, New Year's noodles. Ooh, and actually this is money! Yes, now I can go get that couch! Sweet! And as agreed upon, I do need to go ahead and remove this tree. And then I think the money tree is actually up by Cranston, so I think I'm going to go grab it real quick and then plant it next because putting the money tree down next to the gigantic oh we really need to dig up these gyroids at some point next to the gigantic pile of treasure just seems really on point 
All right, 1,000 bells. See, this seems very fitting for the new year too. Just being able to go ahead and invest your, your hopes and dreams carefully. There, all right, let's dig this back up. And then we'll go plant it in the other spot. Yay! And then we will come over and we'll have a gyroid day pretty soon. Because I love collecting the gyroids every single day. All right, let's plant you. Excellent. But let's see who else needs like well wishes and New Year's wishes here on Wildberry. Whatever Diva's building might be really, really cool. I still didn't have that snowy sky DIY I've been hoping for either. Diva? Oh, Siri, I haven't seen you in a while. Like one whole week. How have you been? Everyone on the island was starting to miss you. And yeah, that includes me. I can admit it. Anyway, great to see you, Gemstone. Oh, thank you, Diva. Hello! Happy New Year! We got a whole new year ahead of us, so let's get hyped, Gemstone. We thank you, Diva. Got a groove going now. This is starting to rock, Gemstone. What you doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? Check it out! I'm making an ornament mobile. Oh, do I already know how to do that? I, I don't think I do. Oh, sweet! Thank you, Diva. Okay, it's not one of the DIYs I was hoping for for winter, but I kind of like to interpret that it means Diva's really into, like, shiny things, sparkly things. And I guess it would be kind of cool to see the ornament mobile just, like, put together just because. Okay, so you need some- oh, you need tree branches in order to make it! Okay, that's kind of precious, I have to admit. Alright, so let's see what Diva's wishes for the New Year's would be. And this is for you, Diva. All right, let's see. I still have four people I need to go ahead and give our New Year's noodles to. Including Julian, because he wouldn't get down. All right, a down jacket. Uh-huh. So I think Diva's mostly thinking about, like, how it's very cold here right now. Yeah, it looks like she's actually thinking about, like, staying super, super warm. All right, thank you, Diva. Hmm, I wonder if, as a frog, she finds the winter to be particularly difficult. So maybe that means, huh, I'm going to put down here, Diva Hot Springs. I'm going to interpret that as she finds the winter to be really hard, and I want to get those Yuzu Hot Springs going again, because they're really cute. And speaking of the Yuzu Hot Springs, anything special to buy right now? Oh, the New Year's Arch! Look at that! Oh my gosh, there are quite a few things that you can actually go ahead and buy, I think, to celebrate the New Year. Oh, wow! Oh, look, the Zodiac! Yes! Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and place an order for the Zodiac Tiger figure. Uh, I'm gonna place an order for that adorable bento box. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and just order all of these, these amazing new items. Because I think we're gonna be able to have some fun with these. Alright. I'm gonna put in two or- No! Okay, I'm gonna have to order more of these tomorrow. <laughs> and hopefully I can get the 2022 Celebratory Arch. Alright, there we go. Meanwhile, at least I can get a little bit more money from these. Alright. There we go, there we go. I'll have to come back to cut down these trees later because I still have some noodles to deliver! Alright, let's see if we're gonna have any luck with Julian or finding where Jay ran off to. Maybe he's over at the beach. Let's see. There's Octavian. We need to tidy up the beach as well. Thankfully, I think our New Year's noodles will be just as good tomorrow. So if we're not able to give them to everybody today... Now he's sitting on it the opposite way. Are you kidding me? Julian! Oh, he got up! Yes! Hey, Butterbean. Seriously, for me? Yes, I have some New Year's noodles for you. Oh, wait, I actually think I only have two more villagers to give these to. And then we'll know everybody's New Year's wishes. Okay, we're gonna make this happen! <laughs> Alright, so Julian wants a He's gonna give us a terry cloth nightgown. You know what, Julian? That actually is fine, because that is another point in the favor of an idea I have for- Okay, that's really cute. <laughs> That actually looks kind of like a little winter outfit. This is another point in favor of an idea I had specifically for him to do with star fragments. So that's just going to put a little a little note that Julian's pretty ready for that idea. And I think we've actually done it, you guys. I just need to go back into Gladys's house and see if she'll go ahead and take my spaghetti. And then we'll have wished everybody a happy new year. 
All right, there you go, Jay, and a fitness take. Okay, so Jay wants to have more stuff to do with like working out in fitness. So noted, I was going to work on making a better little dog sled area over at his house anyway. So I think that's, that's what he wants. All right, and let's wish the last person that we need to in Wildberry a happy new year. Dun, dun, dun. I just have to run at her before she manages to sit down. All right, all right, all right, I can do this. I can do this. And go, 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 go. Oh, yes. Happy New Year, Stretch. Let's make it one to remember. Okay, quick, quick, quick. What's up, Stretch? Gladys, my dear. I have some Happy New Year's noodles for you. You're sure you don't mind sharing? Not at all, not at all. So what are your New Year's wishes? Oh, another tropical cut and sew tank. What? <laughs> All right. Sometimes I think that the villagers actually get those from, like, the Able Sisters. But this is a whole different color. I love it so much. This is adorable. All right. As, like, it kind of mimics a little bit of the Hawaiian patterns and prints that you can see. So as somebody who is Hawaiian, that makes me very happy. All right. Well, there we go, you guys. Once again, Julian has given us some fresh new clothes to wear. We've gone ahead and run around our island to see how all of the villagers are doing for the new year. And let me go ahead and see if there's anything sitting at the very tippy tippy top of our mail, which I haven't forgotten that we need to do some mail days and definitely just some entire streams going through the mail. Oh, look at this. There are a few things. What? Happy Toy Day. Oh, from Hybrid Equalist. Wow, I forgot about Toy Day. Merry Christmas to you and yours from Alex of Mooncrest Island. What? And then, dear Siri, some snowfall for Moss Falls on behalf of Ren. Oh, so that's a like combo between Backlog and Ren. Are you kidding me? Have a cow plant on behalf of Lupana. What? Oh my gosh, I'm so curious about that. What do you mean cow plant? Alert, high alert. All right, let's drop this. Okay, this is so exciting. I didn't know that some of our patrons actually sent something over. Oh, thank you guys. Heck, this is why I need to like open up my mailbox more formally again. Okay, I'm gonna open them in order. So, <laughs> an SLR camera, that's so cool. Yes, I'll be able to act like I'm taking such really cool pictures of all of Wildberry with that. I'm so happy, Octavian is immediately taking pictures of me with it. I did not expect that, and I am so immensely tickled. So apparently he likes to do photography, noted. And then we have got... <gasps> Wait, what? <laughs> I had no idea full body moss suit was a thing. Really? And then, oh my... <gasps> the falling snowball I wanted! Oh my word. Thank you guys so much. I... Egg, wait, eggplant cow. <gasps> it is like a cow plant. Oh my gosh, that is the best thing ever. Thank you guys so much. I am so tickled and touched by all of your gifts. I literally did not expect that. So this was amazing. But all right, guys, yay! We're getting started. We are getting started on a new year in Wildberry. And tomorrow we'll go ahead and we will have, well, you know, tomorrow being wherever we come in next Wildberry, we will have a grand tour of Wildberry for the start of 2022 so that the end of 2022 we'll have another tour and we can compare what the island looked like then to what the island, or like now, to what the island looks like then, which I'm pretty excited about because we've been getting better and better at being able to make our island look super special and giving it the kind of love I've always dreamed of. So, if you guys could, do please leave a like for all of the wonders of New Year in Wildberry. And if you'd like to join us on this and literally thousands more adventures, do please consider subscribing. But most importantly, my friends, stay curious, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye!